Right, first things first, for those of you who are just interested in the, uh, the test footage for this video, jump to this time code now and you can sort of skip the whole intro. I'm out here today and I'm uh, testing out the DJI Osmo 3 Mobile, I think it's called. A short time ago, I did a couple of clips on my iPhone 11 and uh, sent them to some friends and they were like, wow, the video quality is really good on that. And it made me think, I wonder whether or not I could get more of my content done more easily using just my phone rather than using kind of heavy camera equipment and you know something that's a bit less portable but then i started thinking well what about stabilization and stuff and what i want to do today really is just compare the stabilization of the iphone 11 pro and the stabilization of using the same phone but with a gimbal let's get this set up great thing about this is it comes folded up like this so uh, it doesn't take up too much space. It is an extra thing to carry with you but if the results are good then uh, it's definitely worth it. Okay so I'll unfold this like this and the first thing I need to do is get the phone placed in here with the uh, DJ, DJI logo to the top and the camera to the, the top left of that. Put it roughly in the middle and hook this over. And the first next thing I do on here is line up the back so you've got the back sort of balanced properly as well i think it's one of the things that isn't always mentioned uh, in videos relating to setting this up is kind of getting this these two aligned so you've got the same distance between these two spots here then need to roughly balance the phone so that it's not kind of leaning to one side when i let go of it which it massively is at the moment see when i let go of that it's hugely going to one side let's try like that Okay, still a little bit, a little bit more. Yeah, perfect. If it doesn't move like that, that's absolutely spot on. So now if I turn it on, it should just go up, switch it to landscape mode. Good, and we're ready to go.
thanks very much for watching. If you're interested in the Osmo 3, I'll put links in the description. And if you've got any questions, put them in the comments. I try and get round to answering them within about 24 hours if I know the answer. But uh, thanks a lot, and I'll see you soon. So before we set up this, I'm going to ask you to run now because I want to try and keep up with you. <laughs> yeah, no, you're not really in the in the right gear. <laughs> you're not really in the right gear for running in your uh, in your beige jacket. Um, but uh, I'm going to try to run because what I want to try and do is just sort of keep up with you with the camera and uh, and I'll jog. Yeah, jog. Yeah, yeah. I'm not, talking, like not talking about sprinting. Professionals. Oh, okay. Jog. Go. Like, I'm trying here, I'm really trying. <laughs> okay, there we go. Okay, let's go, let's go, I'm just rolling now. So, so all right, I'm just gonna run. Couple of takeaways. Um, it's really, really hard work filming while holding this thing. <laughs> and someone's running, you know. A lot of the stuff that DJI put out about the product, they're conven they've conveniently got people filming on skateboards, but the reality is not everybody can ride a skateboard. And uh, I just kind of think, <laughs> in normal usage, she says, "Yeah, this is really, this is really tough. It's hard work. Are you trying to keep out of it? Are you trying to keep stealthy behind me?" 